super high intelligence level. He's using not only that beak, but his zygodactyl feet to get that nice tasty treat out of that swinging basket there. Now zygodactyl feet means he has two toes in the front and two toes in the back. Other birds that live on the ground are gonna have a totally different foot formation. And so that's how we know that Malachi here does live up in those treetops. Great job, Malachi. Now, you might have said hi or bye to some of our parrots. A lot of them are previous pets, because when we did first open, hi buddy, we did open as a bird sanctuary. So Malachi's given us a lot of clues about his previous home, because he also was a previous pet. Now, we think that he might have lived by the front door at his last home, because he likes to welcome in our guests. Come in. Great job, Malachi. He's also really quite the gentleman. He likes to shake hands and say, How do you do? And Malachi likes to protect our stage when we are not around by pretending that he's a larger animal. And this he might have learned from his previous home because they may have had a dog. Your dog? Oh, that was kind of good. Let's try that again. Dog? says it is windy out here today. Well, I'll tell you what, let's try to play his favorite game. Ready? We're all gonna cover our eyes and, I'm gonna, and then we're gonna say, where's Malachi, okay? Where's Malachi? He said, ooh, great job, Malachi. And we love Malachi very much. And he's only about 20 years old, but he can live upwards of 80 years. Now he likes to let us know that he loves you guys visiting us by sending everybody out with a nice big kiss. <laughs> so again guys feel free to say hi or bye to any of those parents they may say it back they may in fact even say some other choice phrases that's a disclaimer they didn't necessarily learn everything you learned from us trainers here at the zoo now we are going to be going 